Believe it or not, Luffy wasn't always the charmingly goofy captain we know today. In the early drafts of One Piece, he was actually a lot smarter. Oda decided to go in a different direction, prioritizing fun over pure intelligence. So, today we're diving deep into the one and only Monkey D. Luffy. So, buckle your belts and get ready for 10 things you didn't know about Monkey D. Luffy. Unlike some shonen heroes, Luffy has a unique approach to his foes. He doesn't believe in killing them. According to Oda, Luffy sees defeat as a way to crush an enemy's dream, which is a fate worse than death. Plus, who knows, maybe they'll even become allies someday. Luffy loves giving nicknames to just about everyone, except his crew. Why? Because according to Oda, nicknames are a sign that Luffy doesn't quite know someone yet. Once they become Nakama, he respects them enough to use their actual names. When it comes to devil fruits, the gum gum fruit might not seem like the strongest, but that's exactly why Oda chose it for Luffy. The goofy nature of his powers keeps things lighthearted, even in the most intense situations. Plus, it allows for some hilarious gags. Luffy's birthday, May 5th, is actually Children's Day in Japan. It perfectly reflects his playful and carefree personality. Who else could lead a pirate crew with the same boundless enthusiasm as a kid on a sugar rush? Remember when Luffy wasn't affected by Boa Hancock's devil fruit? Some fans thought it meant he wasn't interested in women, but Oda clears the air. Luffy might be a bit oblivious, but he does show some interest. However, when Usopp is around, Luffy gets caught up in his perverted antics, so maybe Usopp is the real culprit here. As we mentioned before, Luffy's intelligence level went through some changes in the early stages of One Piece. The first draft had him super smart, the second one a total goofball, and the final version found a happy medium. What do you think? Do you prefer the goofy Luffy we know and love, or would you have liked a smarter captain? Ever wondered where the name Luffy came from? Oda actually came up with it on a whim, but later discovered it was a maritime term. While he didn't know this at the time, he thinks the coincidence is pretty delightful. With the amount Luffy eats, you'd think he'd be a walking beach ball. But Oda assures us that Luffy's insane appetite won't lead to weight gain, except for maybe a gag here and there. However, he does warn viewers not to try and copy Luffy's eating habits. A healthy diet is key. It's no surprise that Luffy shares some similarities with another iconic shonen hero, Goku. Both have incredible power, a naive outlook, and a bottomless stomach. In fact, Oda himself admitted that Goku was a major inspiration for Luffy. While Luffy does have a biological mother, her identity and role in his life have not yet been revealed. According to interviews, Oda stated that Luffy's journey began after leaving his mother's side, and his focus is on telling the story of this young man. Therefore, his mother isn't currently part of the narrative. So there you have it. What did you find most interesting? Let me know in the comments below.